Can everybody do one thing for me? Yes. Everybody smile. Oh my goodness, y'all are so adorable, y'all are so adorable. Uh, so I heard that you all just got through doing a research paper. Yes. Clap for yourselves, give yourself a hand, give yourself a hand. Awesome, awesome job, awesome job. Was it hard? No. Because y'all are smart, y'all are so smart. And, and I know that you all have imagination this big, right? Yeah. This big, right? No? Who said no? You don't have an imagination? Is your imagination bigger? No. It's not? Okay, well today we're okay, well today we're gonna we're gonna see if we can help you expand your imagination. Is that okay? What's your name? Davin. Davin? Is it okay if we try to expand your imagination today? Is that okay? Yes. I'll take that as a yes. Okay, excellent. So really quickly, I'm just gonna share this story with you all. This is one of my favorite books. It's called The Dot. Has anybody ever read this story before? The Dot? Then y'all should, y'all. Hopefully, y'all enjoy it just as much, if not even more, after this. So, so I'm just gonna go ahead and and read this, and then I'll just share a little bit about me. Is that okay with y'all? Yeah. Because if y'all say it's not okay, then I won't do it. That's okay with y'all? Yeah. Yes. <laughs> I like that shirt, by the way, sir. You're welcome, sir. Nice haircut. The Dot by Peter H. Reynolds. <laughs> Art class was over, but Vashti sat glued to her chair. Her paper was empty, just like this one. <laughs> empty, and that one, just blank. You see, she doesn't look happy, not happy at all. Vashti's teacher leaned over the blank paper. Aha, a polar bear in a snowstorm, she said. Very funny, Vashti. I can't draw. <laughs> she doesn't look too happy. Doesn't look too happy at all. She says she can't draw. Her teacher smiled, just like y'all did at me earlier. Just make a mark and see where it takes you. <laughs> so Vashti grabbed the marker. She didn't drop it. <laughs> she grabbed the marker <laughs> and gave the paper a good strong jab. There. You see the colors in the background? It's a lot of colors. That's a lot of colors. Her teacher picked up the paper and studied it carefully. Hmm. She pushed the paper towards Vashti and quietly said, here, now sign it. You, not, you guys know how you, when you write your name? Yes. She said, now sign it. After she put the dot on it, she said, okay, I'll sign it, that's fine. Vashti thought for a moment, hmm. Well, maybe I can't draw, but even if I can't draw, I can at least sign my name, right? Raise your hand if you can sign your name on the paper. Yes, you can. Yes, y'all can, because y'all can write a research paper. So y'all definitely can sign your name. So the next week, the next week, when Vashti walked into the art class, she was surprised to see what was hanging above her teacher's desk. It was the little dot <laughs> that she had drawn. It was her dot. But it was all framed in a gold frame hanging above the teacher's desk. Imagine that. Imagine if you did a paper and then you had a gold frame around it, hanging over the teacher's desk. Wouldn't that look nice? Yeah. That would look nice. That would look so nice. That would look so nice. Then Vashti said, hmm. She looked at it just like this. She said, I can do better than that. She said, I just put a dot on the paper. I can do better than that. You can just do better than that. Then she opened up her never used before art kit with all the colors, just like in here. All these colors. Markers. Markers. She used the art kit with the watercolors and she began to get to work. <laughs> Why 
That's why, but this is my favorite. You never heard me read it before. You never heard me read it before. I was in your art class. Vast painted and painted. A yellow dot, a green dot, a blue dot, an orange one. Just started painting them. I would do it up here, but we don't have time for that today. We don't have time for me to do an art class. The blue mixed with the red, she discovered that the colors could make a purple dot. Who likes purple? That's my favorite color. Purple and red, it's my favorite color. Then, then Vashti kept experimenting. Lots of the little dots began to make different colors. Just like looking at all y'all today, how all y'all have on different color shirts, different color outfits. If I can make a little dot, if I can make a little dot, I can make a big dot too, she said. Just like y'all. If you can make a little dot, you can make a big dot too. Then she began to splash the colors, get a bigger brush, and then she began to get bigger paper, and then she began to make bigger dots. Bigger dots. Ooh. And then even made a dot, not by painting a dot. Because she was painting dots all around. Then there was just a big dot in the middle. Look at that. Wow. 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 Big dots. Big dots. Big colors. At the school art, at the school art show a few weeks later, Vashti's many dots made quite a splash. Look. Her art, look, all of her art, all of her art, all of her art. Vashti noticed a little boy gazing up at her. He looked just like this. You're a really great artist. I wish I could draw like that. I wish I had an imagination like you do, he said. I bet you can, Vashti said. And this is the part I'm gonna add. I bet y'all can, because I said. <laughs> me? No, not me, he said. I can't draw. I can only draw a, a straight line if I use the ruler. That's what he said. That's what he said. Mm -hmm. Vashti smiled, just like y'all did earlier, with your pretty smiles. She handed the boy a blank sheet of paper. She handed him this. She said, show me. The boy's pencil shook as he drew a line. You see the colors behind him? That's what imagination looks like in your head. It's just a whole bunch of colors going on. It's a whole bunch of colors happening, a whole bunch of thoughts happening. And we're going to talk about that in just a second. Vashti stared at the boy's squiggle, and then she said, Please. She said, Please, little boy. Please sign it. Then he looked at her, confused. He looked at her, lost. He looked at her, uncertain. She's like, why does she want me to sign it? And that's the end of the story.